Hey guys, so as you guys can see, just give me a minute. My guilty pleasure. I just love milk tea with pearl. So, back to the case. As you guys can see, I am currently in the bookstore that I work at, and as I promised you guys, I will be giving you a tour of my bookstore, of not my bookstore, the bookstore that I work at, which is my boss's. I had to stop filming because some management came into the store. So, where was I? So, I'm gonna give you guys a tour of the bookstore that I currently work at. So, come on, without further ado, let's go. So, this table, I call it as the table of sin because because my bosses my boss uh, he display all the popular and new books and like new arrival books and popular high high grossing books right in the middle of when you enter the store and I say wow what a strategy isn't he so yeah as you can see these are all literally just new release books Strange to Dreamer, that's Strange to Dreamer. I tried reading this book, but I couldn't get into it because it's too heavy for me. But I love, I love fantasy books, and I've been wanting to get into it. So I hope, I hope I can get to this very soon. And then there's Crazy Rich Asian. Has any of you read Crazy Rich Asian or the movie? Ooh, that's what it fits us. Okay, I've read this book. This is one of my um, favorite. I wouldn't say it's like top notch, but it's pretty cute. And it's by Adam Silvera and Becky, which two both of my favorite authors. So you guys should check it out if you are a fan of these two authors. Ooh, look, Joan of Glass. This is the special author's collection. Ah. It's so gorgeous, it's so gorgeous. It's one of my all-time favorite series by Sarah J. Maas, the Throne of Glass series. So you guys should definitely, definitely read this. It's a seven book series and it just ended like two months ago, like last year. It's beautiful guys. This is look at this sword. Oh my god, holy goodness. Look. The Hunger Game has new book cover. Like how many covers do you want to get it out oh my god look at that it's gorgeous so pretty so pretty wow another of my favorite trilogy especially as a dystopian one of my favorite dystopian besides um, besides the mortal rules and the divergent series One of my first first ever novel, romance novel that I've read, Twilight. And until now, it's still my favorite, favorite series. No matter how bad people talk about it or how bad the movie was, fell us to one of the best romance stories. Like, oh. Also, one of my favorite author, Marisa Mayer. I loved her Luna Chronicle, and Heartless was one bittersweet book. So you guys should definitely, definitely check her Heartless, guys. It's so good. It's so heartbreaking. I also like how the books are all like, like feels like when you find a book that you know, it feels like you found a gem. Look at this. I've always been wanting to read Roshani Chokshi's uh, books, but I, I bought this like two months ago and it's still on my TBR. Another of my favorite, favorite series by Cassandra Clay. I love The Modern Instrument, I love The Infernal Device, The Dark Artificers, and I'm looking forward for The Chain Gold. The latest books. I haven't read the third book that just came out, The Queen of Air and Darkness, though I bought the books. I'm waiting for my friend so we could buddy read together.
another of my uh, favorite author is Julia Kagawa you guys can see and she is she is my top author as well because she writes really awesome fantasy novels even though they are low fantasy not as as um, par on par with Sarah Jane Mass or, or SJ Jones or Cassie Clare but um, one of my favorite series is the Iron Face series by Julia Kagawa and you guys should definitely definitely check it out it's so beautiful the cover is so gorgeous guys so gorgeous Remember I was saying one of my um, just the favorite dystopian novel? Yes, this is the Immortal Rule. The cover looks a little bit crappy but the plot is so good. You guys should definitely check this out. This is one of the underrated um, dystopian novels by Julia Kagawa. Please check it out. Homo sapien! Ah, this is one of my favorite, favorite book, and it's written by Becky. Um, I, I read this just recently, like last year, and it's it's still one of my favorite LGBTQ book. You guys should definitely check it out. And the movie Love Simon, they are both just adorable. Contemporaries American Potter. Oh, what's in deep blue? Oh my god, this is one of my favorite favorite book too, guys. This is one of the best uh, contemporary romance slash slice of life kind of book I read last year. This is really good. You guys should definitely check this out too. Anyway guys, just just can't get into John Green's books. Like the only book that I kinda like was The Fault in Our Stars and that's all. I read Paper Towns and I was just a bit bearded out because I seriously don't understand what the story was trying to say. So yeah, and I have all John Green books. It was gifted by one of my seniors during my birthday and literally all the books are sleeping at the moment. Another of my favorite author, Colin Hoover. I guess she's one of the best adult new adult novels novel writer for romance. And it ends with us was my first book by her and it literally just shook me because the plot and the story and the characters are just so good, so beautiful guys, so good, seriously. released the wicked king and i'm so looking forward to actually read that holy crap this is a collector's edition and look at how gorgeous this is Oh my god, that is Kel! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, look at Kel! Look at Kel! Look at Kel! Look at Kel! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! I love the drawing. Oh my god, that is Lila Bird! Oh my god, that is Holland. That is Holland. That is V. This is gorgeous. Oh, this is the stone. The black stone. So, guys, you guys should definitely check the Dapper Shade of Magic by Scrap. She writes awesome, awesome fantasy. And this is one of them. So, I found another gem. I'm gonna show you guys. 
the hot cover of Queen of Air and Darkness. Oh my god. This is fucking heavy anyway. Look at that. Oh my god. Thick ass. Hey guys. So uh, that was the big bookstore tour. And I hope you guys enjoy enjoyed it. And I hope you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you guys want more of this kind of vlog or if you guys want to tell me what kind of vlog you want me to do please do comment on the comment section i would definitely read it i would definitely reply you guys make sure you give a like and a thumbs up and please do subscribe to me there will be more vlogs coming out soon and i hope you guys have a good day bye bye